All right, uh, ten three is here on the stick. Really want to show off here today, and uh, I think uh, I'd say he was one the other night. We had him in here as soon as we dropped him out of decks, and was a standout. And I guess kind of uh, still still stands tall here to that same task and thought process here today. So this ten three uh, tends to be handyman's on a top gun. Get it right. Handyman is the board there at Purple Power uh, that I think has done a great job in just getting started, uh, seeing sows and really getting after it and making high quality pigs. Top gun, get it right. Sow would be a sow or be a guilt that we raised. Uh, took her to Sweethearts two years ago uh, when the Rodeball family bought it. We uh, worked with Justin later that summer to try to get her back. We knew it was one that uh, just in terms of her stoutness, her density, her maturity, her hair, everything she had was very, very unique for Hampshire. And uh, we're very, very happy we did because we think this 10 litter really uh, does a lot of good things for us. Yeah, three-dimensional kind of a barra. I mean, uh, he's really cracked open at the base of his chest. He's square and stout in terms of the, terms of his forearm. Yet study him when he gets set into motion with his added bulk and density. I think he really handles his skeleton quite well, and I think he's going to be a really neat one to see develop on, later on in the summer just with his added power and dimension and how well he handles it with his quality of skeleton. Yeah, he will be cut the day after the sale, but just one that I think is a, is a, is a barra deluxe. You know, like I said earlier, there's a lot of people that ask for Hampshire barras for state and I, I do firmly believe that we haven't had a set of Hampshire barrels like this in quite some time. And I think he exemplifies what we're trying to do and that can compete on the highest level.